her idol success 18 years ago. Jessica Malboy has inspired plenty of people. We're talking singers and musicians, actors and the odd TV host or two. But now Jess is using her incredible voice to inspire a whole new demographic, athletes. She's just released the official Australian team song for Paris. It's, you know, it never gets old. I mean, this has kind of happened in the last month and very quickly. And I know that the song had been like in a demo audition for quite some time over the last two years um, with the AOC, uh, with the producers, the writers, Shannon Bush and, um, and Stephen and Mowat. So this is kind of really a huge surprise to me um, that they chose me to want to sing the song and lend my voice to them. And particularly for the, the Australian Olympic team, you know, just... <laughs> I guess putting myself in their shoes, in the like their focus, their motivation, the time that it's taken them to become, um, yeah. you know, Olympic ready. Yeah. Could the writers' names be any more French? Oh, Bush yeah. and Mowat. Bush <laughs> and Mowat. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Let's wish you out for lunch and, at Bush and Mowat. Yeah, that's yes. right. Uh, now, the athletes had a bit of a hand in coming up with this They sure song. did. I mean, uh, you know, a collaboration between the athletes, the AOC, the uh, Australian Olympic Committee, um, and particularly the writers. I, I mean, this is really all about them. And I think, you know, having a song um, for that moment before they hit, hit the field or they get up on that podium, they they, you know, they, you know, stand on that track. This is that moment, that alone time, where they gain that confidence and yeah. gain that knowingness that they've, they've, they've come to a point where they're ready. Yeah. They're ready to do this. And so I, I really wanted to passionately put that emotion in that. And I remember si sitting in the studio, going, having goosebumps, going, oh, I can imagine. I can imagine them, that moment, that quietness before that storm. You know. So. We've got the national anthem, which is the national anthem. Yes. So this song sort of becomes the unofficial anthem oh, for the Australian team. Very cool. And how are you going to inspire them? Well, you're going to go to Paris. I'm going to be and there. And sing it for them. So yes. tell us what the plans. Um, so this is exciting. Mm. Um, again, like I said, this has happened all, all in the last month. And, um, and I want to go over there. I want to perform it physically for them um, and give, I don't know, that home, give that kind of sense of homeness for them, and um, so you sing it to them live. They, they all yes. assemble in one place, the, which actually is probably the first time they all come together anyway. Yeah, and you sing it at the at the flag bearing ceremony, yeah. um, and then hopefully um, sing it at the village where I'll get to go and, and see them all in in, in their in their you know true form. Yeah, so this will be very special. Jess, you could win a small goal. This could be such an inspiring song. Stop, I can't. You, you <laughs> could be responsible for our greatest goal haul ever. Oh my gosh, honestly, I, that's that's what I wanted. I wanted to bring that motion alive physically and, and mentally too. It's it's all in the preparation. So the performance is going to be different for you, for you because I know you, you do lots of different stuff in many different venues, but... I'm so nervous. This is really, really important, yeah, this is a really I'm, important it, gig. Yeah, it is super important. It's like, it's probably the most important moment for me, I think, you know, the representation of our country, of our athletes that are going over to to, to win, you know. Um, this is this is big for all of us, yeah. So you're using your vocal cords, that, that's the muscle you're using, but if you were going to be an athlete, what what at what <laughs> sport would have Jessica Malboy have represented Australia? If you had to choose one, what do you reckon you would have stood a slim chance. Oh, I, 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 probably the soccer. I yeah, think. okay, you played uh, soccer? I, I, yeah, I was pretty athletic yeah. as a kid, so that's something I would, yeah. yeah. I would and you're getting, you'll probably get to see Matilda's game while you're in Paris. <laughs> that so that would be that's awesome. Great. <laughs> uh, how are you going to psych yourself up for this big performance that you said you're nervous about? Oh, I normally do burpees. Like, I would do probably, like, for every show, I do 10 burpees, and that gets my, my, my blood pumping and right. going, yeah. and at least my body ready and warm. So, yeah, probably that. Um, <laughs> 
you've been on tour lately? Have you? Have you... Yes, I yes, have. Yeah. So early this year, my um, Yours Forever tour mm -hmm. kicked off in April um, throughout May, and um, I yeah, I, I I couldn't help myself, but I extended another two nights um, at, at the at the Palms in Melbourne. So that's something that I'm looking forward to really curating and, and creating. And that's, that's coming up soon. That's coming yeah. up soon. The NEMA is obviously the Indigenous. Um, yeah, the National Indigenous Music Awards, yeah. which is, yeah, I'm always, I always feel honoured to be there and, and commu um, to sing for my community. Yeah. 18 years, we said uh, in the introduction. I can't believe it. 18, 18 years. 18 years. Yeah. That's wild, right? Yeah. I, when I think about that, I'm like, I'm really surprised at how much I have still passion and I love performing live. So good know? to see you. We yeah. can tell. Jessica yeah. Malboy's new single is called Higher. It is available to stream or download right now. The unofficial team anthem for the Aussie Olympians. Good, good on stuff, you, Jess. Jess.